Hello and welcome back to Football Tactics and Glory and Manchester's Journey to the Premier League. My name is Rio and last episode we crushed Providence 5 to nothing with Olsen scoring all five goals. He has been ridiculous these last four games. 12 goals in four games. He's averaging a hat trick over the course of four games. But now we take on a little bit more of a challenging opponent. We have Oklahoma City, who are currently in third place. And also, this happens to be the 100th episode of this Let's Play. It's not our 100th game, because I've done some two-game episodes, and then there was one episode I just... Well, one game I just completely missed, didn't record at all. Uh, but 100 episodes. It's been quite the journey to get us to the second league here, and we're going to hopefully put on a good show for this one. Now, they've got Mullen in the middle, but otherwise... And they've got Proctor there, so... It's not going to necessarily be easy for Calvert to break in, but he could still try. Uh, Cowdell, I mean, he's a good goalkeeper. That control, especially, is going to make it difficult for Olsen to, to get any goals. Um, however, I think because they've got the setter defenders both on that side, we might be able to get... A, a chance for a cannon shot if we can get Calvert out on the side. As for here, yep, we gotta stop Simpkins with his 76 control. That layoff pass is going to be worrying as well. Uh, I think I'll adjust back to this so we have someone, if Simpkins comes down here, to block that. And then having Shatter right in front of McCrary, who's definitely their strong, a strong, uh, forward. But other than that, I think we're good. Novak has been getting a lot of playing time. He's played nine matches this season. He hasn't done much in those matches, but he's been playing. I think this could be a good game. I think we can give Oklahoma City a challenge. I wouldn't be surprised if this is the game that snaps both our winning streak and Olsen's goal streak, but we're not going to go down easy. And here we go. Starting off, uh, Oklahoma City with the ball. We are here in Oklahoma City. And Pittman can't get it by Bowers. Do they have someone to bring up? They are going to bring up Dickens. And Dickens just goes for the tackle. He probably could have he could have gone for the slide tackle, but I guess they didn't want to on that play. Bowers takes it away from there. Roman. Now, Roman can false kick Paulson out and then could go in, but Mullen's probably going to take it. If we do that, we're still going to try, and it doesn't work out. Paulson with the ball. McCrary's moving off to the side. And the long pass gets him over. Can he get it by? He can't get it by Tompkins. Tompkins doing a good job there. Now Shatter moves up to take it. Shatter, I think if we move him up again, I think we can get it, yes, to Olsen. And Olsen can take the unlikely shot. He gets it by one, and it's saved by Cowdell. Okay. How's their control? Yeah, they've got they've got enough players with good control, and I, I don't think it's worth bringing Doss up. But Roman's going to take the corner. Olsen's taking the middle, and Calvert's taking the back. So Olsen's gonna get another chance, hopefully, to score here or not they've they've been adapting i think to my strategy oh man 215 that's just how are we supposed to get anything off that yeah and this is not going to go anywhere 
does go to the corner, so now Calvert can come here, and maybe he can keep it from Proctor or Dickens, whoever they bring over to take it. They're taking over Dickens. Dickens goes for the slide tackle, it doesn't work. But he is motivated, so he's going to try again, and this time he gets it. Dickens with the ball. Passes to Story. Now, I really don't want Story to be able to do too much, but it might... Yeah, I think we're going to move Calvert all the way back, because we got to get off this press. He does have a layoff pass, unfortunately. So that's going to make things difficult anyway. I guess Roman can start moving back a little bit. But we do force Story to go for the lofted pass. McCrary keeps it away from Shatter. And McCrary dribbles past Tompkins. He is going to get a get off a shot here. He goes for the shot and McCrary scores. He got by Childress and Hodges, who had an excellent game last time, couldn't keep it. Now Calvert. Calvert has not had many chances for break-ins recently, mainly because it's just been easier for us to go to Olsen. But Calvert's coming in now. He keeps it from Proctor. Can he keep it from Mullen as well? Yes, he can. Calvert on goal. Can you, can he equalize here? No, he can't. It's saved and it doesn't go out of bounds. Mullen comes over. What is Mullen's approach going to be now? He moves out and passes to Pittman. So over comes Thacker. You could tackle, you could slide tackle, he's gonna slide tackle here. And can pass to Olsen. And Olsen can try and get it past Haynes here. Or can try and pass it to Calver. Oh wait, no, that would be offsides. They've put him in an offsides trap, so Olsen goes for the unlikely shot and doesn't get anywhere. Oklahoma City with the lead. Haynes with the ball. And he does get it back past to McCrary. McCrary can try and get past Tompkins again, but it doesn't work out. However, Light, with his pretty good defense there, manages to take it. Shatter can't take it from from him. Instead, we're going the slide tackle with Tompkins, and that doesn't work. So it's up to Bowers, and Bowers can't take it. Nobody could take it away. And now we are in serious trouble. The pass gets to McCrary, and McCrary alone on goal. Yep, there was no chance there. Once again, we're gonna we're gonna attack with Calvert here. Now, I I don't think it's a good idea. Well, we'll yeah we because Proctor's there, he can intercept on that. So I think breaking in is still the best approach for Calvert, and not doing a cross or anything like that. Mullen takes it away. I I knew it as soon as I. <laughs> went over there. Okay, well, that is the end of the half, and that's a disappointing performance so far. We've, we had a couple chances on goal. Calvert's break-in and Olsen's shot, but neither of them fell, and McCrary is a really strong player. Uh, I think, actually, I'm gonna swap over to that so that if he gets by one player here there's gonna be a chance for the for someone to take it away so if he attacks Shatter Tompkins can take it away attacks Tompkins Doss can take it away all that uh, it might be too little too late on that front but we're gonna try anyway and 
Let's say if they score another goal, then Roman's coming out and Greer is coming in. But in the meantime, we will start with the ball, giving Calvert another chance here. And we still can't use that skill, unfortunately. So we're gonna break in. Now this is a little worrying. Proctor's got a good chance, and he does take it away. Yep, that's that's all we can do here. Thacker will move slightly into the middle. In case, yeah, they wanted to attack this side. Story gets the ball. And gets it by Bowers. McCrary with the ball. Can't get it by Tompkins. It goes to Doss instead. Doss does get it to Thacker. So Thacker is going to try and get it to Calvert. It doesn't get there, unfortunately. And Olsen can't take it away. So Haynes with the ball. And he's got some options. He gets it by to Simpkins. And Simpkins has the layoff pass, so he gets it over to McCrary, who keeps it from Tompkins, although Tompkins is motivated now. What's he going to do with it? He's going to move off to the side. And goes for the shot, and Hodges saves this one. Shatter the ball. Can he? He can get it to Roman, he could get it to Thacker, but neither of them will actually give us an extra move. However, if I move here, hmm, that's still not going to be enough. Roman will get it. Roman is just going to false kick Paulson slightly out of the way, passes it. And Olsen has the ball towards the box and gets it taken away very easily. Their defense is just too strong. However, Olsen intercepts the pass and then it's taken right back. So, he's strong at the moment, so that, I don't think Thacker's, Thacker can even slide tackle. Yep, he can't slide tackle, unfortunately. So we're going to get a press out of Roman and just an attempt out of Thacker that goes nowhere. He is motivated now, so if they for some reason kept the ball there, which they don't. Story with the ball. Lofted pass. Tries to get it to McCrary. It doesn't get there, though. And McCrary comes out for it. Once again, Shader is very busy in this one. And unfortunately, he's not going to be able to get any extra actions here. So we're just passing to Bowers. I mean, he could have gotten it to Doss, but what use would that have been? Light takes it away. Light can now pass to McCrary, or not. He's moving out. False kicks. And goes for the shot. Which thankfully is saved by Hodges. Good moves by the computer there. Pittman is coming in and McCrary is in the middle. So we will have Tompkins starting McCrary. We'll have Shedder in back. And Doss will also help out there. Shedder keeps position. And Tompkins takes it away from McCrary. McCrary is motivated. So he could go in for the tackle, especially with Pittman. There. And McCrary has the ball in the box. And Shedder fouls him in the box. And Shedder's out for three matches. I've never had that happen for just a normal tackle. Uh, it was a risk, and it did not pay off there. Uh, we're going to take out 
Hull and put Thornton in. There's, and uh, we're also taking out Calvert and putting Greer in. There's, there's no point. We're, we're not going to come away with a victory in this one. And I think this may be the first time I've had to save or try to save one here. Uh, I don't have the dice with me. I'm just going lower right. And he goes right down the middle. And that is a goal for uh, probably McCrary. That's three goals for him in this whole time. Greer is coming over. Greer is going for the very unlikely shot, and that came way closer than it should have. I can't believe he actually got it on goal. And the... What was that? I have never, never seen the AI do something like that. We're bringing up DOS because, I mean, why not? And they're guarding Olsen in back. They are guarding in front, so I think Doss, hopefully, if Thacker can get us a good good pass here. Whoa! Doss kept the middle position. That's unusual. And it's just completely missed. No, no one got that one. But Doss comes in and can't get the tackle. Haynes with the ball on our severely weakened defense. Yep. Pittman with the ball. Is Pittman... He goes for the shot, and it's kicked away by Childress. Now, Childress could try and get it there. Instead, we're going to Thornton. Thornton is going to move up. He's going to pass to Bowers, and that's going to end the game. Oklahoma City defeats Manchester 3 to nothing. Oh, it wasn't McCrary. It was Simpkins who did the penalty kick. And, yeah. Not how I wanted the 100th episode to go. Especially not after just the amazing performances of the last few games. Men of the match, Thacker, Shatter, and Calvert. Sometimes these games happen, and we unfortunately lost a really big big part of our team here at a poor time. So we lost. Columbus beat Honolulu. Bismarck beat Madison. Tampa beat Birmingham. San Antonio beat Albuquerque. Nashville beat San Jose. And Des Moines beat Providence. We are in seventh. San Antonio managed to pass us with that game. And our next game will be against Columbus. Columbus is the team right behind us in the standings in eighth. Uh, they've got a sweeper, center defender, left defender, and right defender round. Uh, not the strongest offense, thankfully. We, we don't want another McCrary situation. Uh, but we do have one big thing we're going to have to do, and that's find who's going to take Shatter's place. And I think that's going to be Thornton. For the time being. Also, yeah, uh, we're getting close to the end of Shatter's run with us. Oh, may I may have messed up here. I might not be able to sell him in time. That's okay. That's that's going to be something. Uh, we can't, yeah, we can't sell him until February 1st, and he turns 34 in November. Oh, that's, that's unfortunate. That is something I'm just realizing now. Well, it has not been the best episode for us <laughs> in a lot of ways. But hopefully we can have a bounce back episode against Columbus, and then our next one after that is against Nashville. I was hoping... I was hoping for an easier, an easier opponent in the cup. Yeah, we got Nashville. Look at, come on, Providence gets Augusta here. What's, what's this? We, we should have gotten one of the easier teams, not dealing with Nashville. 
Anyways, leave a like if you enjoyed the episode somehow, even though there were no Olsen fireworks or really anything positive for Manchester. And comment below any thoughts on the upcoming games and how I messed up with Shanner. Subscribe for more Manchester content since we're not stopping at 100 here. And I hope to see you all next time. Have a great day and happy gaming.